All right, YouTube, I'm back finally. So I got some more parts for the Evo. Um, I just wanted to say I got a lot of uh, comments about the Evo in the uh, last two posts. Um, thank y'all for the support. Granted, I'm not making a million views, but you know, getting some views is is pretty awesome. Um, yes, old Blue Will. Um, start to make more progress i'm still kind of planning out what, exactly what i want to do um because old blues build will probably change some because i have the evo now and some of the things i was going to do with old blue i don't really need to do anymore so old blue might be a little more fun if you know what i mean anyway back on task so i got a few parts that were I'm assuming they were on the car at some point. <clears throat> I got the OEM uh, rear wiper arm. And uh, it's kind of hard to find all this stuff in the States because, you know, this car wasn't born here. So I looked up the OEM part number and then I cross-referenced it um, on the O'Reilly's website, I think it was, because I used to work for O'Reilly's and AutoZone, and I worked for a little mom and pop um, auto parts store right out of high school, so I kind of know how to swap parts, uh, part numbers around, um, and I was able to um, find it. So I have that, and I also have, since we're trying to work on the aesthetics of the car, kind of bring it up to my uh, standard here. If I can get this out the damn bag. These are for the um, valve cover. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to just do one at a time. So I don't disturb the uh, valve cover gasket. So with that said, let me put this camera down and I'm going to set up everything. We may put some more parts on. I have something else that I want to do that goes under the hood that um, I think the car desperately needs. I don't know why every car doesn't do this. I think every car should have these, but you'll see, you'll see what I'm talking about when we get to that point. So let me get to that point.
something else. Let's open it up. What is this? This is hood struts or bonnet supports is what you guys on the other side of the pond would call it. But I saw Tom's Turbo Garage in his, on his Galant VR4 put a set of these and it was absolutely dope. So we're gonna put these on. So let me get set up for that and you guys will see it then. All right, guys, so long story short, they want to make this sound like it's so freaking complicated, but it's not. You have this grease, this little grease container, and this is the ball that the other side of the uh, hood strut attaches to, and they want you to grease this. I don't see the point because I don't live in a climate that's... <laughs> hardly cold ever but I will comply take off the 10 millimeter bolt here and I would say before you go full Rambo on it make sure you know you it's in there straight and you're not cross threading anything I'm gonna just go ahead and knock out the other side while I'm at it Scratch that. I put the wrong washer on there. What's funny is when you buy these struts, they want you to watch Mighty Car Mods, which I don't dislike the channel, but can't give the some clout to a small channel. Hint, hint, wink, wink. You know, just throwing it out there. Yeah, this looks a little better. Give it a little hit. All right, that shouldn't go anywhere. All right, we're gonna flip this around. Obviously guys, don't throw these away you ever need them one day you'll be glad you have them another fun fact Mighty car mods they had green grease I don't know why um, like I said I don't I don't get the point of putting grease but that's what they say to do. And now, I guess I'll just go ahead and do this side once since I'm on this side. Probably the logical thing to do. Oh.
let me finish this up and then I'll show you the end product and hopefully I did it right. So we'll see you then. All right, guys, finished product. Got the hood struts. I did shut the hood and made sure it was <clears throat> closing properly. Excuse me, I'm still a little sick from a, having a cold a few weeks ago. Got the, uh, the new bolts in. And again, I'm not putting any right here because I don't really know if I'm going to just put the factory one back on or if I'm going to get the match until May one. So, what do you guys think? What do you think of the hood struts? Who's put these on before? I mean, how do you like them? I mean, it makes it pretty effortless. I hate putting up that little arm thing. I, I can't stand that hood prop. Excuse me. Anyway, guys, so that's going to do it. I know y'all probably never seen me smile before on the channel, but I am so freaking happy. Um, a lot has happened this year in 2022. Not all good. Um, lost my brother-in-law in August. And uh, whew, it's not easy. Um, he was a big part of our life. Um, but, and I'm naming this car after him. So I know some people think it's stupid to name their cars. I name all mine. So this car is going to be called Dale, the Evo. So, um, that's the name of this car. And I'm going to dedicate this build, you know, over time, obviously <laughs> I can't, uh, do a frame off restore, but, um, I'm going to dedicate it to him. So, and if you guys have been here, you know, through this journey, I started actually posting on this channel um, January of the same year, but this channel's existed since 2007. Um, but now I'm kind of starting to be, get serious about um, putting content on here and all that stuff. So, um, but I wanted you guys to, you know, see that, I'm human and, you know, losing a family member is really not easy. Um, I'm, I'm glad, I, you know, I'm glad I can do what I do and that I'm a, I'm alive to do it. You know, it kind of puts things in perspective, so to speak. So, but we'll do more mods on the, on the Dell, the Evo here. And, um, I, I actually have something really dope. But I'm doing research on how to install it. Put in the comments what you guys think it is. It's probably really not what you guys think it is. But I, I need it because I'm getting old. But um, love you guys. Uh, thanks for sticking around. And um, have a good one. And if, this, if I don't make another video before Christmas, Merry Christmas, guys. Love you. Bye.